What's up? Hey, f do you know Baby Laser or those tiny boys? What's up? Do you know Baby Laser? What's up? Do you know Baby Laser? What's up? What's up? What's up? Do you know Baby Laser? Do you know Baby Laser? Do you know Baby Laser? Do you know Baby 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 Laser or those tiny boys? Do you know Baby Laser? Baby Laser? Baby Baby Laser? Do you know Baby Laser? Do you know Baby Laser? Do you know Baby Laser? What's up? Do you know Baby Laser or those tiny boys? Hey, fucker, you like the Raiders or what, bro? Hey, do you like the fucking Raiders? Do you know baby laser? Do you know baby laser? Do you know baby laser? Baby 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 laser or those tiny boys? Baby laser or those tiny boys? going Brian that was yeah. good move that away in and out like a vibrato yeah dude I'm in uh, that Doppler effect tremolo effect what do you got
Welcome. Welcome. <laughs> Enough flange. It's like the 80s in here. It's, uh, yeah, you got a lot of neon. You got a lot of um, phase shifting. You know, that yeah. was invented in 1980. I'm an 80s kid. Uh, you'll learn all about phase shifting. It's how Fortune gets the bullets to fly all around her. And uh, it's, you know, Patriot technology. I want to find out, though, first off, you know, the big question. I went, oh! Uh, are we skipping frames? Are we choppy? How's the IRL chat looking, Brian? Is, they're looking here. good. You know, I'm looking at the uh, at the frames. I'm looking at uh, them staying at numbers, but we were Give us a, a one. little bit. Give us a one if everything looks good, sounds good. I see some yas in there, so that means, you know, stocks are up. Yeah. Yeah. Well, yeah. <clears throat> Uh, but certainly be smooth as eggs. Okay, cool. All right. We are, uh, you know, going through it here with the Mega 64 internet. I don't know what's been happening in the months past, but I think we're in the process of solving, you know, incrementally. Little adjustment here, little tweak there. So uh, let's see if the adjustment that has been made will bring us good fortune. Unfortunately, <laughs> it's not going to bring fortune any good fortune no it Brian, is not we're really really close to the end of the game and uh i don't know if i'm ready for this metal gear solid summer stream to end fuck oh i, I don't know if i am either uh i'm just I having am, actually i'm having so much fun yeah i'm a little i'm a little ready to, to hang my hat up uh, just with the controls, and just to get something else on the show for a week, I think it'd be yeah. Uh, but we got a lot of cutscene coming up. We got uh, basically like two boss battles, right, Brian? Yes, I think so. We have kind of like a mid boss right before. Yeah, we have like three boss battles technically. Yeah. Okay, and I think uh, we'll get to the end by. The end of the show today. I think so. Yeah, I, especially I think we'll if wrap we skip up. through these codex. Like, God, such a beautiful song too. We get to listen to. Uh, yeah. Can't can't say goodbye to yesterday. Oh, oh, I love that song, especially the piano. Can't give version. up yesterday. Yeah. There's a lot of good versions of that. Oh man. Okay. So uh, the AI we know is jacked. Oh yeah. What are the controls with this? I need that block is vital, especially for some of these boss fights coming up here. I think the block is important. And then it's all about swipe, swipe. You can click it in, and they poke. I forgot about that one. How about that shit, bro? Oh. R3. Oh, wait. Hold on. Don't go in here with no health. Well, I've got the rations equipped. Oh. Sorry, you can't see them because of our pip. Oh, our pip. <laughs> yeah, because I'm looking at the monitor. <laughs> You're looking at our pip. We got multiple uh, I'm monitors. I'm like, please don't it. do this to us. <laughs> uh, we Instant do. Death. We do have the wheel going today. Mm. Uh, Discord's there. We're going to take some Discord calls. Like I said, once... We get deep into some cutscenes. Absolutely. We're going to try to focus and get through this. Uh, very reticent of the frog soldiers. It does, yeah. I mean, this ch this egg came before that chicken, but you know what I'm saying? Okay. Refamiliarize myself. Oh, wait. So now it's just a shooting gallery. And Snake's going to keep giving me M4 ammo. That's so right. That's, he has infinite ammo. That's the way to do it. Use the M4. Come at these guys. There's that. Reload. Reload is there. Okay, I think I got this shit. See, they can only, uh, you know, dodge my bullets with the swords for so long. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hey, what's all this nonsense? Uh oh. I know. Got jacked. Oh, what is this? Oh, fuck. Why? Bro, it, is, it doesn't say the right thing. The fucking AI. Oh my god, it's so hard to concentrate now. Uh, oh, you mean the UI? Yeah, the user interface. You're right. But GW like is so corrupted now that uh, it's just like breaking the game. Like yeah. this, this third wall, fourth wall breaking shit is like so fucking so, cool. So, so that, Kojima. That is oh, exactly fuck. like the uh, battle with. Um, Psycho Mantis for yeah. this game. Yeah, true. And and it's also like the elevator ascension. Yeah. And there's two of them. Fuck. Yes. It's so hard to see on it's my little so ass screen. so hard. You're right. I don't Admit. know if that's any better. Oh, I'm out. Oh. Um, what I do like, or what I don't like about this part, is that this reminds me of the one time, or the first time I played this game, No Kill, and I was using the HF stun. 
Oh, the blue side. Yeah, and I was doing a really good job until I knocked one person off the edge. I. Because it's an elevator, right? Yeah, so if they fall off the edge, they're done so. Damn. Well, that's uh, a death, and I was very upset. That's one death. Yep. Brian goes for total no kill run. Yeah, it, it's weird for me. Like when I hear other people, they talk about like last week. People were saying Metal Gear kind of went in the direction of allowing you to shoot and kill and like blah blah blah. I always felt like it penalized you because you just felt it was so much harder to play if you killed everyone. Like if you were stealthy, yeah, I mean, it, it alerted, just required patience. Yeah, it alerted backup, so it was more yeah. guys. Then they bring tank. Like in five, it brings on the heavies. I've never seen like real air support come in in MGS five. Uh, for some missions, it's no, like they required. already have a. Yeah, you're right. It is required. But like sometimes I've heard people like get it so messed up that like they call in reinforcements. Five stars, like five stars. Yeah, in GTA, and then GTA. planes <laughs> or, or like a you know their own chopper comes in and they do an airstrike on yeah. you. So yeah, I think it's. I mean, that's that's just fun to see the different styles of play. Yeah. Especially again, it, I feel penalized for killing. I always do in these games. Yeah, well, in the later games too, like Peace Walker and Five. Yeah. It helps you by taking the guys back. So I would kill because I would want to bring mother base members back. Exactly. With me. So it kind of helps you in that way. Yeah. So people who said that they didn't really like. Yeah, so four would be the optimal one where it was just kill everyone because they're all PMCs. Four and four, I pretty much and rising, I guess if you want to count rising. Yeah. But uh, yeah, that's kill them all. But uh, this run, I think I started out not killing. Yeah, you always do kind of like that. But then Try, when the, when but the then, shit hits a fan. Yeah. But then when it's a cutscene where it's an elevator and the guys are coming, it's like, well, I'm killing. You know, I think I did that in MGS one too last year. Oh, okay. Yeah. Uh, should we go to? Our first sure. Discord caller. Yeah, I I'm going to drop that link in the chat if you guys want to hop into the waiting room. Why don't we talk to Zarek? All right. I, uh, I don't think we've spoken to Zarek. No, we haven't. Zarek, how you doing? <laughs> how you doing, buddy? Hey, what's yeah. up, man? Fucking pissed. Kevin is a little jealous. He's away from the studio, and he misses his PPS boys. But uh, you're chilling here with us on a hot Wednesday. Oh, dude, I'm chilling. Straight chilling. He's straight chilling, Brian. Oh, let me turn your volume up a little bit. Oh, yeah. Oh. There you go. How's it going, guys? It's yeah, going it's better now. We got your, night. we got your volume cranked so we can actually hear you. You know. Oh shit! <laughs> Shouts out. <clears throat> so, uh, I've just been planted into a uh, crouch, kind of like a dimensional field. Like there's nothing, no walls. Is this inside GW? How are you doing better? Are you it, inside a room at might least? Might be technically on top. I think we are on top of the ship. Are you uh, are you on top of a ship right now, Zarek? Are you talking to me? Yeah. yeah. You inside oh, a? No, I think it's just my AC. I got to turn that off. Really no, quick. no, no. I I can't hear it, dude. Stay cool. Don't yeah, turn the AC good, off bro. for me. <laughs> all right, sounds good. Hey, well, it's nice talking to you guys. Uh, I've been a long time listener of Mega Sixty Four the podcast, uh, all the stuff, and oh, hell uh, yeah. I I really love uh, the PPS. Oh. Um, nice. I wanted to call in because I loved uh, that you guys had Charles Carroll on. Like a couple yeah. weeks ago. Shouts out, yeah. Drop that Big <laughs> shouts out to my boy Charles. He kicked uh, off our stream, actually. Oh, oh. Yeah, he uh, awesome. he started this summer's Metal Gear Solid summer stream. Uh, it was great. It was really a cool. fun time, man. A real fun time. Full of mirth, indeed. Yeah. Yeah. Um, <laughs> Very mirthful. Mirth. Yeah. <laughs> um, me and Charles actually worked together on uh, his Mr. Pregnant video. Oh, um, okay. Cool. You, what, what was that like? Uh Tell us about that. I like. Uh... Well, I've been a fan of uh, MDE for a long time. Uh, my friend showed me a lot of their videos back uh, in high school or something like that. And then when I went through college, uh, Sam actually hired me to do some editing on like pre uh, World Peace materials. Very cool. Did you and get then... to go over to his like? Uh, you always see like in the background of his videos like, like that apartment of like a computer and yeah. editing bay <laughs> and like it seems like he's working with a couple people. They got like uh, pegboards and shit. They're businessmen yeah. doing business in there. Yeah, and right now he's really doing well. I'm actually really happy for him right now. Uh, yeah, it, I went over there. This whole probably... Epstein shirt design is so fucking oh funny, man. <laughs> have you seen the shirt design, Brian? <laughs> no, I have not. He Sam's a fucking madman. He 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 put a thing out like <laughs> a contest of some kind about you know like not graffiti but like street art on your own private personal property, of course. But like. People are straight up, like, tagging his at Leroy on fucking Epstein's, like, New York and Florida homes. 
Like the fucking what? the gates out hey. front. Oh, it's out of fucking control. And uh Yeah, some people have been tagging his Instagram handle on Jeffrey Epstein's like personal estates. Oh and my stuff. goodness. What what uh what insanity. It's been a, a hell of a fun watch this, you know, like whole story unfolding across Twitter. I'm just like Absolutely. uh Mainly, I, I really like, I, I feel like he gets shut down so fast on anything like Twitter that Instagram seems better suited. And so far, he's lasted a while. Yeah, well, his old account got uh, removed or something Say like it that. Ain't so, so. This is his new one, but that, that's, that's beside the point. Well, I hear, like, the new hotness um, is Gumroad. Like, if you get on Gumroad, <laughs> yeah. you do it through there. That works out. Absolutely. Oh, um, God. Working with Charles was great. Uh, are you... Are we still connected? Yeah, yeah, I'm yeah. with you. Oh, yeah, we're oh, here. Oh, sorry. It looks like you're saying something, and I'm like talking No, to you. it'll look like we're always saying something because oh, we have constant right, yeah. noise. Uh, yeah. Yeah, uh, I actually uh, I met Andrew Ruse when I was living in Los Angeles. Uh, Very cool. A Andrew, and Andrew came out to uh, some of the Mega64 Last Laugh live show. Not some of them. Oh, one that's of them. great. When was that? Uh, like, oh, what was that? Yeah, I saw, I saw a post about that. Yeah, that was really cool. That was pretty cool. I've always I wanted to I want to check out your guys' live show for sure at some point. I, was I remember just really... we were trying to sneak into Comic Con somehow and like get a get over to your booth. We didn't know how to get in contact. <laughs> how with you to guys get in? Time, yeah, uh, we were shooting something in San Diego, and we were like just right across the street from Comic Con. We were trying to get in. Got to do the sneak. Uh, <laughs> the sneak. <laughs> Andrew was really cool, man. I was like so uh, elated to meet him and like just chatted with him and Charles real quick out front of our uh, our our uh, our comedy night and uh yeah that was it, that was great uh, i i was so inspired by like man his editing style and uh, you know charles said it great like how he's the best working director editor out there and uh i don't know pretty speaks pretty highly of him but for good reasons like his stuff is great he's definitely out there as far as his style and uh, they definitely have their own thing going on that's for sure I've I, been, I really like what they do I've been interested in uh, some of the new videos that Charles has been putting on some of the streams yeah. I've been able to catch his mini streams lately but uh, yeah I'm glad to see all the boys out there doing their thing seems like yeah, Nick's been showing really up in a lot of stuff again what's that it seems like Nick has been uh, showing up in a lot of stuff too uh, who Nick <laughs> Three times a charm. N I C K, Nick Roqueford. How do you say oh, his last name? Yeah, right. Uh, I think he's just been working with Sam on some stuff. Uh, I think Nick's got his own um, uh, antique store he runs. That's, that's, that's what I always hear. That's what everyone always mentions his antique <laughs> yeah. store, which I find I, funny. Uh, is being <laughs> that's known for as I know. running an antique store. I really i have never met Nick before. Uh, Sam flew me out uh, from uh, the West Coast all the way to the East Coast to Damn. shoot uh, Kickstarter TV. Uh, so I shot 16 episodes with him, and we're kind of slowly putting those out as they're getting edited right now. On Very cool. Account. So that's awesome that you've been uh, picking up some uh, some gigs, like and working with people that you uh, enjoy their content. That's right. like so you can't ask for actually, more. I know, honestly, that has been my whole life story: is meeting the people I've always admired, always wanted to work with, okay. in the niche sense. Like you know, I, I'm not really a big fan of. Uh, you know, Paul Verhoeven or whatever the heck, you know, just, I like these <laughs> niche guys. Um, yeah. And so, uh, what's so funny is how I much want crossover on the there's been. Yeah. There's been so much crossover in the fan group of like, um, well, I used to watch this guy named Robert Benfer who did like the clay world animations and stuff. And like, I don't know. There's like all these great people that have like these, the clay it's all world. the fans that have connected like everyone together. I feel yeah. like. Yeah. Well, I mean, all these I'll, groups. I'll shout out our, uh, our our fan base constantly for being so talented you know whenever people ask like you know how do you guys get art or where do you get artists you know and it's all from our community and people grow up and move on to do like big things it's so fucking impressive like just seeing the creative uh side of our community and our friends that we meet just through mm -hmm. doing like cons and events and yeah stuff. i know game days yeah. is coming up i can't wait to see like a bunch of our friends again uh <clears throat> Out in Anaheim, oh, I should have fucking unequipped. If but uh, in that's cool, man. Is, you know, working in the film or the creative industry, just keep with it. You guys just are super talented. You guys will just push through. You know, yeah. You got keep it. making, make keep funny going. shit. You know, like make funny shit. You never know what's gonna get 
a shit ton of views, like what you have in your head swimming around that you think is even like, oh, this is a dumb fucking idea. But like, man, you never know. Like you put it out and it could connect with people. I feel, I feel like that's 90% of my stuff. <laughs> yeah. This is a bad idea. I shouldn't do this. Oh yeah. Oh my God. That, um, it, that's yeah. uh. well, you got to take some risks too out there you know don't be sloppy with it but uh get, take some risks but that i don't know it alienates people i mean you're too fucking weird and look they try to cancel sam how many fucking times yeah. Bo boys uh he's undead he's living uh, oh yeah he's living dead girl he can't he can never die <laughs> oh my god these fucking brian i gotta get the you gotta do the chaff, you gotta, you gotta get the, the knees, then you gotta go to the mouth. Gotta go to the knees, then the mouth. That's important. Yes. Well, thank you very much uh, for your discussion here yeah, today. Zarek, Thanks for that calling was an awesome in. Awesome call. I'm uh, yeah, I'm stoked uh, that you're you editing great, with these guys, so man. Keep at it. Keep you're you're great too. So keep working on uh, new stuff for the uh, MDE crew. Stay in contact with those sweet boys. Alrighty. All See right. you later. I'm sending my love. Good night. Good night. A little love for awesome my man. Call. That was a great, great Zarek, call. Great to hear of people out there in the field doing a little editing. I'd like to get more into my editing, Brian. You know, every once in a while, I'll make a fig-like video oh, for the personal yeah. channel. Oh yeah. Put up a new kind of uh, extra found footage laying around my phone. That's how the fig videos kind of oh, incept. I mean, you also oh, have that cam. Oh. Well, yeah, I, yeah. I also understand the. Uh, not it's usually the like, well, it's 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 just what I got kind of convenient so yeah. I, made, I made a little bumper last week Ooh. put that up but uh I'd li I, I, I like do it. stuff for work a lot like I do tutorial and training videos for the construction companies oh no shit yeah every once in a while they're like yeah we need this tutorial we're gonna put it on our website I'm like I'm your man you should charge him well it's part of my uh you know I'm working there hourly still I ah. still do part time some part time work I see very smart you gotta keep your foot in the door and then what yeah. do you say that I'm, a cons I'm consulting I'm a I consult so that's how you get the big I'm money a I'm getting horny now just thinking about I'm it. thinking about that dollar sign baby. that's right you okay. say, yeah, you smart man did I drop the chaff I think I did oh uh, no I think I did you no. did not uh, oh yeah I did oh there it is just, okay. it just popped alright just pop hit, hit the knee hit the knee focus on the knee focus on the knee and now hit the mouth and now that's oh yeah, big yeah. Damage. that mouth, a big damage in the mouth. Open up. Also move. Gotcha. Also move. And I need that ration up front. Yep. Damn, son, your knees has been raw. What are you doing? So if you get oh. too close, he fires the, the, the laser. Gun. But uh, oh, if you keep right about there, I think you're good. And yeah, if they're doing this, and just boom, hit hit just the pepper. knee. Just pepper. Pepper them knees. Boom. Now that's one oh, right I down. Got one. Whoa. Yeah. Now, in that last cutscene, they said there's fucking 25 rays, and you can see them all back there. Yes. Uh, I don't think you actually deal with 25, but no. keep moving. Oh, fuck. If you hear that beeping sound, you That's should... when it's getting too close. Yeah, it means Shh, they've, they've right. been fired. You're right, you're right. Ah! Okay, do the do. The do. Get, get out. Get it. Let's go. Okay. Let's go. If you're fast enough, which I never got... You can like make it so that they almost never fire the uh, the missiles. Yeah, I don't know about being fast enough. Cause this is not it. This ain't it, Chief. <laughs> I fucking hate that saying, as many do. Uh, oh man. Hell yeah. Sometimes I realize, Brian, I'm complacent in how horrible things are. Right. Until I listen to someone else rant or complain about it and then it makes me realize like oh yeah that's horrible oh yeah oh fuck Ooh, you can get that rash i can get that pop another chat i can get that oh no fuck okay did i don't it, know how you didn't get hit by did that did it but... no i think it it unequipped what it's still there what is happening sir okay there <laughs> that was weird i thought very you weird oh my god All right, let's get another chap out. I don't know how I didn't get hit by that. Whoo! I thought I'd have more time in between those cutscenes. Okay, get out. That's behind him. 
Nah, I hit the one behind him though. Yeah. That's fucking yeah, cool. Yeah, it works fine. I mean, yeah, you, I did you not can, mean to. I'm, I'm you can spamming. tackle whichever one you want. Yeah, like in this case, like you can fire two at a time. It's mm, just uh. He went down. He went down. Move. Yeah. Dodging, dodging. Yeah, and and see, while the chaffs are now, the uh, chaffs out, they have a much harder time hitting you. You are right. Um, with the missiles. He's out. I would He's pop dying. another uh, chaff. You gotta move. Down. Gotta yeah. move. Whoopa! I got you all in check. All right, chaff in. Uh oh. So I'm gonna equip it and then take a hit. Take a hit. Oh, didn't take the hit. Okay. Hit that Metal Gear Ray. It's amphibious. Oh, no, no. Hit, hit the mouth. Hit the face, open, baby. Yeah. Face, baby. All you got to do is hit one knee, and that takes out like a 40%. Hit, the, hit that, hit that, hit that. Yeah, watch this guy. He's going to pee on you. No peeing. Looks like pee. <sighs> What's with the game and everyone peeing? Remember, like, you, you're on the edge of Big Shell and the fucking pee from the soldiers? Yeah, like, on we, didn't, we didn't get to see that this time. It's on Raiden's head? I yeah. Think we, I think we saw it in one of the streams. Um, oh, oh, shit! shit. <laughs> oh, fucking hell. I rarely seen that move, 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 yeah. Whoopsie! Yeah, just wait. Yeah, you got it, though. And then um, afterwards, we need pop a chaffer. Chaff. Let me just fucking get yeah. Oh, I got so greedy, dude. Yeah. Fucked up. Fucked up. Fucked up, dog. Get up. Ah! Oh, stuck in the <laughs> iframe. Iframe, baby. Uh, roll immediately. Yes, and don't even equip this fucking yeah. gun. Oh, roll into a crawl. It worked. Okay. Somebody did fire off a couple. I hear that shit. What? Got to finish him. Oh, that's not. Oh wait, that is. Wait, why is no, it that's different? It. You, you just were in the wrong view. Oh. Whoa, fuck. Oh, oh, boy. oh, oh boy. yeah, I need to go back to the rations in the center. Focus on that. Got him. Get him out. Let's try. Oh no. There we go. Ah. No, nope, get out. Let's see. How many fucking Metal Gear... Oh, fuck, Brian! <laughs> Every time I get it out, he does the kneecap ones. Son of a bitch. Oh, again. I guess if you keep him down, he won't get that out. You can also <sighs> dummy fire it, like... That way you don't have to wait for the lock Well, you on. can connect it afterwards, too. It's weird. It's like if you fire before it hits, you can. You have a couple seconds to connect it, it seems. Yeah, like I would How's do it now. How's my shit unequipped? Because you were out. Oh. That's yeah, so I, I shot. Now hit him in the mouth. Yeah, fuck. Don't have time. Ah, oh, fuck. I didn't matter. Ration's back, though. Yeah, all right. No, baby. Okay, equip him. Please. Okay, sup dude saying you're uh, you're too far away. That's why they keep doing the they missile attack. They do keep doing the missile attack. So stay in mid-range. Yeah, just like Whoa. the other way. Or other you're way. right. Oh, you had it. I thought I'd got Oh uh, No, you got his knee, but then he yeah, had yeah. a lock on his mouth. But hold on, I want to throw a chaff out. Ah, fuck. <laughs> yeah. Throw that chaff out. Oh, I already did. Okay, okay. Oh, man. Oh, man. Shoot him. My ration's down. There's a fucking mouth shot. Now he's done. Now equip these. Yep. Bounce. And I think your chaff is about to. He's end. gonna die. Oh no, he's. Rash yeah, he's back. shooting. He's shooting. He's shooting. Woohoo! Got your knee. Yep. Now. Got your mouth. Got oh, him. Brian, that's that is a winning combo. Yeah. And then now you just do it again. Oh 
fuck. Mouth. Uh, yeah, don't worry about those ones. They don't, ah. they don't ever get close to you. You have two rations, so you're good. You Let's just got more stinger. Let's keep yep. throwing shaft. So no deaths yet. Whoopsie. Oops, that's behind him. Whoop, there it is. Open that gizzard. Right near amphibious. Oh, another one. Mouth. Oh. oh, shit. I heard that way last minute. Where are you? There you are. There's one, and there's two. Where are... Who's next? Get it, get it, get it, get it. Damn. Oh, shit. Whoa, I don't know how that worked, Brian. But uh, I did some... Olympic shit. Nice. Oh no! How could you? One there, one Watch there. Watch out. And then dodge. And I think I got both. No. Yep. And then uh, when you can chaff grenade. I got that one. Oh look, he's bleeding. Ooh, baby. Ow. And grab that rash. You got it. You Boop. Good. Oh, dude, dog. Dizog. Stinger. Ow, that's not good. No, you be all right. Oh, fuck. Using up my rash. Oh, whoa, way Chill. too high. Way high with the analog stick there. Get out. Get out. Get close. Yeah, oh, I prioritize fuck. getting the health. Now, book. He's hitting me. Book. Once, <laughs> once these missiles hit, then and then that the knee. one. Yeah. Kneecapper. Open wide. That should put him down. There's a cutscene, baby. See, first try. <laughs> what are we on, too? Normal, I think? Your regular? I don't think we picked easy. <laughs> Might have. Feels like we haven't had much resistance. <clears throat> Damn. You know, uh, when Solidus came out here and started talking all this shit in this, yeah. in this uh, you know, last cutscene here, he calls me Jackie Boy. <laughs> oh, you're right. He's like, yeah, let her rip, Jackie Boy. Just thought that was nice. Boom. A nice touch. We all thought it was over here. Well, who comes in to save? Whoa. Snake at the end of one. You got Frank Yeager in the ninja suit. Sans ninja suit. You got Olga. Yeah. You know, she's playing her role. Yeah, it's so fucking cool. This is really these last cutscenes where you get like the full info dump. On, oh yeah! Like AI, the simulated uh, societal sanity. Man, this part when I when I played this game at like 16 or 17, I'm like, what the fuck yeah, are dude. they talking <laughs> yeah, about? Yeah, I mean, what just happened? I couldn't even understand. Like I was getting some of it. Like I like I was like, wait. So I wasn't. I was actually on the bad guy's side. Wait, what? And then I'm like, yeah, it was it was wonderful. It was that's why these games are so good, and I'm not worried about uh, Death Stranding. You know, yeah, like yeah. we're at that point now where video games has so, like like film. It's bigger than film. Like film, it has so many subgenres. This is an art house video game. Oh yeah. So we're gonna not get your normal like in every Metal Gear game your normal gameplay style. You're gonna get a very unique gameplay style. Yeah. And, and I'm you excited. Get, you get such a like drama yeah like of uh you know this actually this cutscene got super fucking violent too yeah dude this specifically was so cool george this, sears on the, on the thumb yeah solidus is a fucking badass character he's like the darth maul of the series he just wasn't used a lot he he was a pawn yeah uh, really to tell this story fuck that was so unexpected yeah i didn't really prepare for at the time like full so crazy. short range shot to the fucking head main character yeah. is executed full execution fuck your corpse like whoa that took me out oh. when when the cutscene happens i mean how defeating for raiden you know he's like yeah that that shocked me it yeah. was like it, it was like when i played red dead redemption the, the first one and i and the first time or i don't know if anybody had this happen 
But like, if your horse dies in that game, oh it's like, God, yeah. I was like, what? No. Well, I would even oh. in the second one. It happens more. I feel like your horse gets stolen or it dies. Well, I was really good about keeping my first horse from the beginning of the game. Yeah. So, he was the one who I had to like put down at the very end of the game. Like you have that little touching moment. Yeah. Like, and I was just so like, oh, that was that was a well written moment to oh, pull man. at the heartstrings. Made me uh, feel something. It's it's these I games feel, do something, man. I feel more emotion playing video games than I do watching film. Oh, absolutely. Or television. I feel like oh. that's true. I mean, you, you're you're more engaged. Yeah, it's my avatar is you know. Yeah. Is it's happening to me in a sense? I'm controlling the action. Oh no! You know, the fucking Rexes all started freaking out or Rays. The I Ray, mean. yeah. It, it seems that Ocelot's telling Solidus now, like, there's a worm cluster. Some virus must have got in. Who did it? Uh, maybe the Patriots, but GW's infected. It's going down, and he's freaking out because <laughs> now he's kind of realizing, like, uh, I got nothing. Oh, now he's bulking up, man. He's going to beat up all of these Metal Gear. So he's yeah. the first, like ultimate warrior like what ends up what jack ends up being like he he follows in his father's footsteps yeah he's even named jack you know jack the ripper <clears throat> uh and isn't solidus no solidus's real name is george george, george sears yeah. george sears it's funny big boss's real name was jack but snake's real name is david yeah uh liquid's real name is eli but two jacks, Raiden and uh, yeah, old big boss there. Really, just yeah, such a fucking cool character that just wasn't. I mean, played his part perfectly in this. But how cool would it be to get like Solidus and sequel games? Right. Just do more with the character. Oh, like, you got to do the uh, like Ocelot's such a main character. Second torture scene here. Yeah. And Ocelot is throughout the entire franchise, yeah. Is he in the original Metal Gear and that, Metal Gear 2? The MSX versions? I don't know. I don't know that because I've honestly never gotten all the way through those games. I've just yeah. kind of played the beginning of both of them. It's so weird seeing them in this cutscene, like, handcuffed. You know, they're going to walk the plank on top of Arsenal here. I think this is a plan. What do you mean? Like, I think he worked something out with Fortune. Well, in this cutscene, you know, like, Solidus reveals to Fortune that, uh, you know, I know you're going to double-cross me and steal Arsenal. It's like, it's spy versus spy shit in this cutscene. It all gets dumped. Yeah, that's right. Because Ocelot's working for the Patriots. Solidus is working for himself because he just wants to hijack GW only for the names of the Patriots so that he can make a kill list and assassinate all 12s of, uh, of the Wiseman Committee. But Fortune, she wants to steal Arsenal, and he's like, you can fucking have Arsenal. I was yeah, going to give it shit. to you because it's fucking useless to me. I just need these names. This is like the full all cards on the table. Everyone reveal your hand. But then there's they, they manage to keep fitting twists in. All right, let's save over our earliest. That's it. And let's take just a quick... Ooh. Maybe laser or... Commercial.
Yeah, it's working. And then we come back and it stops. Pervert. <gasps> it's not on on that side now. It's, uh, no, 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 on that side. But, uh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna restart. Let's see, uh, continue. And that'll count as a death, but whatever. <clears throat> Interesting, like, how the FMVs look compared to... There we go. Like, I don't know, that looks different to me. Yeah. No, it's got a little bit more blur. I think he wanted frame rate over resolution. Yeah. Whoa. Just had to make sure. Do it hot. Oh, we we knew sup, dude, but we we just had to take a break. We hadn't taken one yet. We've been going for 14 minutes. Ah, here what it comes. did we know? What did sup, dude? They were warning us that we were going to have to mash triangle. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. But thank you. Appreciate it. Oh, my God. I'm doing the uh, one finger kind of like off to the side oh, technique, like slamming it against the table. You're, you're good. It's going to bring it down no matter what, but you're good. Maybe I need a knuckle rub. Um, I'm going to get real close. Oh, it just that's it? One? It's a one For shot? For now. I think there's uh, no, one I more think, thing you do. I think that was it. No, I think there's one more. Oh, you'll grab me again? Well, just in case, let me get a guest All right. from our Discord call list. Oh, let's talk to a friendly dad. A friendly, friendly dad. dad? How you doing? Oh, hello. How you doing? How oh. you doing, Poppy? I'm, I'm doing pretty all right. I didn't realize I was going to be here. Poppy's well, in yeah, the dude. house. <laughs> uh, well, we realized that we were going to pick up on you, friendly dad. So, you know, we want to hear what you have to say. Are you sitting here watching Metal Gear 2 for the first time, or you've played this before? Um, not really. Um, I've played MGS5. Oh, hell yeah, but, brother. Um, <laughs> my, <laughs> so good. Hey. Uh, my friend is a big MGS fan, and he wants me to play too. Because you should. It's the most artistic. You know, going back at it now, I don't know why I never picked it up in between its release and, and 2019. I really like. Maybe it's because it was like locked in that generation of like PS2 games are hard. They're in that era of stuff that's not easily emulated or re released anywhere. And I don't know. I just. I've never had the need yeah, to replay it yeah. until now. But, but I, I am can't... really enjoying it. Yeah, I kind of realized that with, like, that generation, like, GameCube games. Like, I realized how, uh... Yeah. Kind of very, very... They... they Because they are... They cost a lot more, and... Like, just going to, like, a local video game store, it's just... They've just Old shot Old GameCube price games, and, yeah, the price is up on those. gray area. So, uh... What kind of games have you been playing? You up to anything current? I saw some Mortal Kombat uh, 11 announcements tonight, and... Wow. <laughs> Fucking, you want to know how I got these scars? Because, yikes. The Joker looks so bad. <laughs> that fucking reveal. <laughs> oh, yeah. I, I think I saw something with that, and I saw the uh, Terminator. It I looks, thought the Terminator was pretty good. Terminator bad. looked good. Yeah, I'll give him that. Uh, everything's looked good. Like, the last game had a great, you know, Freddy, Jason, uh, Predator, Alien, or whatever else was in there. Fucking Eddie from Iron Maiden. But this fucking... Joker looks like it looks like a cosplayer. Does it really? It looks so fucking bad, Brian. It's Let's not see. the Joker, baby. Joker, Mortal Kombat 11. Make him like DC, like Injustice fighting game. That's oh, like very yeah, cartoony <sighs> Joker looking. Like, dude, it just looks like Heath Ledger's makeup on like a fucking cosplayer. I, I think this is what modern Joker might look like. You can fuck right off. They're, they're trying to mix fucking uh, Robert Goulet and... and uh, huh. Jeez, it's bad. I probably have a few different skins for him, too. I'm sure. Yeah, those games always do have a lot of skins. Yeah. No, I thought a big Ash announcement was coming, but not. Oh. I, I heard that shit Delta leaked G, months baby. ago. But, uh... Yeah, are, you're, you're not playing anything local? Or local. <laughs> You play any good local games, bro? Um, you play any well, uh, current I was playing stuff? Gary's mod with, I was playing Gary's Mod with my friends yesterday. Yeah, um, I totally never really, I kind of miss the uh, the golden age of that. But uh, it's very interesting. It's, it's great that. that the golden age can always be replayed through physical copy. Oh, yeah. As long as we retain this hardware. 
But uh, Gary's mod was something I never really dabbled in. Yeah, <coughs> I'm a big I'm a big fan of the uh, the Valve games. Uh, Half Life gotcha. is probably one of my favorite series. But uh, how's Gaben doing? I haven't heard much about the Gaben. Uh, um, anything I good know, coming I, out of Gabe's camp lately? I'm kind of up to date on that. I don't know. Um, I just know that they're dealing with like putting chips in your brain so you can. Oh. Uh. <laughs> I know they got a new VR headset that is apparently the shit. My buddy oh. James is telling me the new, the the actual like Valve VR headset is now the the like top king, oh, eight number yeah. one. I thought I thought I heard some some stuff about it not being like that great though. I could totally be wrong about that. Uh, I'm not you know, really up to date that's on what that. the internet's all about hearsay. I say yeah, this, you yeah, say definitely. that, and neither of us know because we just heard it from two of our dumbass friends, right? Sorry, James. <laughs> But I, I'd, I'd be glad to be your dumbass friend, James. I say shit that's wrong all the fucking time. This is the big info dump, Brian, where he's saying, like, Fat Man was orchestrated yeah, to, get, everybody. to get Stillman here. All we're doing is recreating Shadow Moses to, so GW can test if it works. And it does. And now I'm taking the test data home. Like, that's all that's Ocelot's right. doing because he's in the Patriots. That's right. Essentially, he's a double agent for him. Mm -hmm. but. Anyway, you know, the the plot lines go thick. But uh, Super Dad, or Friendly Dad, excuse me. It's kind of, yeah, it is cutting out a little bit, so. Well, I, I do want to yeah. know how your day went today. Were you doing any education uh, or any educating? Or were you at work? I, what did you get up to? Yeah, I was being educated. I uh, just got out of community college. Oh, oh very started, good. Started on Monday, yeah. Very, oh, just started Monday. Yeah. How do you like it? Um, oh, it's great. It's like my fourth year because I have no idea what I really want to do. Oh, uh, no, don't that's... worry. I did the same there, thing. But, um, yeah, that's very just common. Just doing some art stuff, yeah. Hell yeah. Well, enjoy your time there. Uh, yeah, yeah, definitely. I am. I like the uh, I had two attempts. Smaller... Two community college attempts. Not not so much successes. Oh, yeah. But you stick in there, bro. <laughs> You gotta just get that fucking piece of paper and get out, and then yeah, they yeah. look I'm at that. For, yeah, I'm eligible for a few associate's degrees. Ooh. Oh, that's good. See, get the fucking paper, yeah. but I'll yeah, get them. Get the paper. And, uh, get that transfer. money. That's what I'm about. The I was, hustle. I was actually. Um, I, this isn't like my only saving grace, uh, but um, I was actually the guy that uh, I you saw at Target that one time. Oh shit. <laughs> You're out there wearing Mega64 merch in the wild, dude? Yeah, just a Were little bit. Were you the bit, one yeah. that they told you to forget what they saw there? No, no. He he stopped I me don't, on don't my know. way out of Target. And uh... I was. I feel like I probably looked bewildered because I might have been in a rush. But, always are. But honestly, that is just always me <laughs> fucking running late trying to fit shit in. And then it's like uh, I give bewildered stares when someone says my name in public. Like, what? How do you, oh yeah. How do you know me? And my face starts going like, how do I know them? How do I know them? But you know, I'm I'm getting used to it. But uh, shout out. I was actually very like nervous. I was like, oh no, I, I didn't I was, notice that. Um, I felt like probably like kind of like when I was walking in my car, I was just kind of like, oh shit. I just meant like Garrett. That's pretty cool. <laughs> nice. See, here you are. You're being nervous, and there I was. I was nervous that I acted like a buffoon or something you know, in, in replying to you. So here we are both oh, no, feeling no, I, insecure. I feel it was pretty, it was pretty great for the most part. Oh, I walked back to my car, kicking my fucking feet going, wow, why'd I have to be such a dumbass? Why'd I say that? Oh, hi, good to see you too. I've never seen him before in my life. Why the fuck did I say such a stupid fucking thing? You know what I'm saying? Like these are the things in no, my head no, as I'm walking. Fine. It was fine. Y'all got to chill. Well, true. We all got to chill. Dad, can we, uh, can we have a truce on this and just chill? I think, yeah, I think we can. Yeah. Okay. I'm Repeat fine. after me. Uh, I can chill with you anytime, Garrett. I can, I can chill with you anytime, Garrett. And we can chill together the next time we see each other. We'll just chill. And we can chill the next time we see each other. We can Hell chill. Hell yeah. Well, that's good. Close enough. I, I, it's chill. I know. Yes, I. I'm it's no. Keep it. Keep it loose. Keep it chill. You know, I got fucking audio flagged for that. Really? That like, way, like, like it's there's so much like uh, modulation. Modulation on that 
sound bite and it tied it to the fucking Return to Innocence song. And it's like, that's not even the fucking song. It's the Peruvian singers, you yeah. dumb fucker. But, uh, you know, let bygones be bygones. What are we going to do with an advanced AI like GW running things? I don't know. GW, Google, Westinghouse, the subsidiary of Google that makes electronic toasters. Think about it. Could be a sign from Kojima way back trying to warn us. <laughs> uh, thank you again, Westinghouse Electric uh, Corporation. Uh, the first incarnation of the Westinghouse Corporation uh, was an American manufacturing company uh, founded January 8th, 1886. That's a long time ago. So, you know, they've probably got old money. They're probably all tied in with the lolly lolly low. I don't want to talk any shit and have someone hit me with a heart attack gun. I don't want to get epstein if you know what I mean. Oh my god! Oh, Jesus, Jesus Christ. Christ! We're gonna take a break! Dad, say hi to Sean. Hi, Dad. Dad? He's fucking gone. Fuck. You speaking? Mm hmm Who's this? What time you guys open till? And uh, do you guys have Disney movies? Yes, we have Disney movies and we're open until midnight. Okay, listen. Uh, is anybody else listening on to this? I, I don't want, I want to come in there and rent a, a porno. You guys carry them? Yeah. Well, I mean, is anybody going to see me? Is this going to go on my permanent record? Depends on who sees you. What do you mean? Depends on who sees you. I don't... Hold on for a second. Why don't I put someone else on the phone to speak to you to talk about this? Mm-hmm, all right. Hello? Mm-hmm, who's this? This is Al. Lewis, listen. Uh, I want to come in there and rent a porno. Would you guys have any problem with that? Who is this? This is Lewis. Lewis who? Lewis Montgomery. No, you can only rent porno, sir. I can? Yes, you can. As long as you're over 18 and you have your ID and membership. Okay, well, listen, that other lady said I couldn't rent them unless I had a big thing, and I don't I don't appreciate that. <laughs> I don't want to. I don't want to be harassed. Though. I just want to come in and get what I got to do and do what I got to do at a big bit of boom and get out of there. So can I come in and take care of this? Yeah, you can come in and rent a porno. Okay. Um. I, how about that other lady? Is she gonna be like throwing popcorn at me? Cause uh, you know, I all I wanted to know is if you had pornos, if I could rent one. And she said, No, ain't renting shit. Get the hell out of here. You know. And then I said, Put your manager on. So then she put me on. Put your manager on, baby. Uh... I appreciate that. So you can uh, come in and rent, okay? Okay, I'm gonna come in and rent. So Sean scared the shit out of us. That was pretty cool. But great call. Uh, thanks, Dad. American Dad. Who is that? American Dad? Famous Dad? Laughable Dad. Some Dad. Some Dad. I'm not a Daddy Dom, but... The cutscene is still playing out. Fortune is using her real luck charm here. Ocelot is revealed as Double Cross. He's saying that, you know... Basically, he told Fortune he killed her dad, he killed her husband. Uh, he dismantled Dead Cell according to the will of the Patriots. That's right. And she's not magic. She can't dodge bullets. She's just got some technology that the Patriots gave her. He straight pulled another crazy move and point blank shot her in the heart. Yeah. But her heart's on the other side of her chest. Because she's weird. She ain't dead yet. It's like a real syndrome. It really is. It, there's a name for it, like... Uh, Dodecahedron. Hey. Swappy heart. Swappy heart. I think that's it. I think that's technically it. <sighs> uh, Sean really fucking freaked me out. Yeah, I, mean, I could I was, tell. I, uh, I was a little startled. I'm not going to lie, but I yeah. apologize. Should we say an apology to the White Westinghouse uh, Corporation? No, we're probably fine. Conglomerate? No, they don't Google, technically exist anymore. The Google overlords? Bro, my toaster says different. It's probably listening to me in the kitchen talk shit. They uh, they became Viacom, and then Viacom oh, got that's even merged worse. with CBS. No, that's worse! <laughs> so it's Viacom CBS now. Oh, and then Google on top of it? No. Nah, GW? Actually, I don't think Google is owned by that at I, all. I know. I, it's all owned by the same Patriot, baby. There's 12 Patriots? You make up 12 different company names, cut the head off Hydra, how many new... 
corporations grow in its place. You know what I'm saying, Brian? Yeah, the alphabet company. If you use your head and you really uh, open your ears. <laughs> You can understand. Nice. You can understand exactly what that means. You know Look, what I mean? what's this? Oh, brother! It's all, <laughs> It's liquid ocelot. Yeah. You know, and now uh, Solidus doesn't even know what the fuck to do. He's like, "What's going on?" And I love that they show the old game footage. Yeah, especially for myself who had never played. Metal Gear 1. Oh, on your first playthrough, you didn't play 1? No, Oh, man. so you were really like, what the fuck are they talking about? Yeah, no about? idea what was going on. And then I, that, but that, in, in great design, that made me want to go back and play Metal Gear. Yeah, so oh, I, definitely. I sought it out, and I played Metal Gear. I bought it, actually, I bought it at that Toys R Us, you know, our childhood Toys oh, R Us. Oh, my God, where you would go get the flag off the wall I, on the envelopes? It was later. It was, like, when I was in high school, oh. um, my brother was going to, it was 2003 when I bought it. I remember that, because my brother was going on his, like, or no, 2002. He, he was so they going used on to have the flat, you would take yeah. the paper, and then you'd go to the front like booth yeah that had a little window with someone working just in there to sell video games a loft box yeah that or like other high high value items yeah. that you know people would obviously just steal out of the package cool he's got that fucked up vein arm ocelot Man. liquid ocelot here you know it's cool that the voice changes the actor goes to liquid's yeah. voice yeah um you know that hand Ora. that hand twitches out yeah he looks and now like it's basically weird. like he's saying he's got all he needs s3 isn't a system to keep people in control it's a solid snake simulation and right. we're just we're grooming right in to see if we can run a scenario as an ai and we just proved that we can so ocelot just bring us back the mission data and and the disc that we gave Raiden, that worm not a worm well not designed to erase GW, just erase the data of the 12 Patriots that Solidus wanted to kill. Exactly. So it's like they get him to upload the thing. This is crazy because it's just like the tanker incident. Like, what are you doing, Snake? You're diving in. He Later in a cutscene, he says he puts a tracker on that ray. So they're tracking that ray back to the Patriots. Oh, right. Okay. But, I mean, when does that happen? I guess when he dives in. Yeah. But then GW is now on, like, a crash course autopilot for Manhattan. Federal Hall. Which I really thought it was going to take out the bridge. I remember playing this before. So that was them, like, outside at sea the whole time. Yeah. But now you can really see the fog is kind of, it's, it's brighter. Oh, yeah, it always looks like it was going to take out the bridge there. I thought it was. But it's, it a, it's a tall bridge. Yeah. But a collision course, nonetheless. Oh, oh yeah. yeah. Carves through fucking part of Manhattan. But yeah, the they were basically under where the shell, the Big Shell was. Yeah, because it launched from Big Shell, right? Yeah, it was just a cover-up so that they could build it there. An oil fence. But you know what's funny? Yeah, they don't show it crash. It's just... It's there, it's rammed into that building. Is that stuff they cut because of 9-11? Like we don't. I distinctly remember it crashing into, into a bill into the shore. Like yeah. there's never the boat of Arsenal coming to the shore, the dock, and bridging the streets yes. and crashing into Federal Hall. That just I'm not touching control or anything. It, and that was the videos I watched online too. And it's like, I think that the, it just got cut, maybe uh, because of the 9/11 thing where the game got delayed for them to remove the twin towers in the intro. Maybe they also decided to, like, hey, let's cut this fucking destruction of Manhattan. But how do I remember seeing it? I, I think your brain makes it up because it's obvious, like, wait, how they get there? Oh, they must have crashed. Okay. And your no, brain I remember fills in the seeing gap. it. I mean, you might have watched uh, some behind the scenes. Maybe the chat knows what's up. They got erased by the Patriots, dude. They're fucking... Oh, my God, Brian. The Patriots are doing that... Uh, What's that Benghazi effect? No, Mandala effect. Yeah. Take, take that back. Mandala effect. And uh, they're erasing it from your brain, so it never was there, even though we remember it. I have asthma. Oh, my Dude, God. what the hell? I got vaccinated and got asthma because of the fucking la le lu le lo 
Oh my. That might be, uh, there might be screenshots of the cut content in an old magazine or something like that. It says Quizno. Could be right. Maybe. Got removed by the Game Boy AI. All of you were cut content in an old magazine or something like that. Oh, I'm reading as it scrolls. Know what I'm saying, saying? I know what you're saying. Sup dude's got some info about that uh, document of MGS2. Maybe showing a little extra. But uh, I think, Brian, uh, we should look back to Discord one more time. We've had a couple good calls. Sure. I mean, just this is a uh, wait, wait. Maybe we don't want to fight. No, it's still cutscene. Yeah, it's still cutscene. Okay. I'm looking at this like screenshot. Yeah, maybe I've oh, never that's seen cool. it. Yeah, I was supposed to like knock over the Statue of Liberty and cause more damage. Can I get a screenshot of that? Oh. Mike, sh Mike just shut off for some reason. That's the one, though, that you just tap it quick, not put it in a Bluetooth. Yeah, there that's it. Okay. Uh, how do we do that? Throw it. Uh, if you throw it full screen on your computer, I'll take on your screen. I'll take over and, and let me see. Okay. Um, this would be fucking pretty dope. Let me see here. Desktop three, would it be? Yeah, look at that fucking thing. Yeah. So it, bre it bridges the tip of Manhattan knocks down some shit and maybe they just like did not want to show that yeah i mean it kind of like you know you yeah, know barrels through half the city <laughs> right like little two sensitive. months after 9 11 like I, I could get that a little sensitive but i'm surprised it was taken out of the japanese version too yeah this must have been uh printed maybe it's a second printing or some shit it's definitely... Oh, it's Substance. So, it's... Sub oh, so maybe it was taken out at this Oh, no, point. wait. This is Substance. Uh, the game we're playing is not. It is the original. Sorry, it's not Substance. I'm wrong. Go huh. figure. Okay, so the fight is about to start. So maybe I said take a Discord call, but I think I jabbered on too long. Here's uh, the AI basically telling you to, like... Hey, remember, uh, well, don't fuck remembering. We don't care that you know. We're not exactly human. That's like the beginning of that Fingers right. song. You know, it plays the stuff from this cutscene. And he's telling you, like, we're going to kill Rose's kid if your vital signs dip because we're all hooked into your nano machines. So if you die, Olga's dead. Oh, and we're keeping Rose hostage. And... She's dead, and your baby's dead. So all three, if you die, if you don't defeat Solidus, like, that's what's going to happen to you. So he's got kind of no choice. He's still like, I have to comply yeah. with the Patriots. He doesn't even know if Ro if they really have Rose, which, P.S., they don't. I mean, I love when she shows herself as the AI to him, though, with the white eyes. Like, her eyes are all whited out. Oh, really? Oh, dude, it looks so freaky. There's some stuff, like, we're skipping through, you know, because we oh, said we'd I skip Codex. I never saw the white eyes. Oh, when it really starts to break down. Here's big, big info dumps. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, look at how fucking long that's going. Raiden and Solidus, though, are about to fight. And uh, I cannot game over. The Patriots mission must cannot. come to fruition. Boom. Okay. Vision L. Well, what you dare, just went through. Dare we take a quick call? Let's do a lightning yeah. round call. All right. Who's on? Let's talk to hey. Rob P. We haven't talked to Rob hey. in a while. How's hey. it going, hey. Rob? Hey. What's up, Rob? Hey, what's going on, guys? How you doing? I'm, a, I'm doing well. I'm about Congrats to have a, on... I'm about to have the end game boss fight, baby. Hell yeah. That's right. Hey, uh, so you're a, a, a film guy. Let me guess. Did you call to talk about some uh, movies that have been released recently? Uh, um, actually, I was going to talk about a movie that just got announced, Matrix 4, man. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, I, yeah. I uh, am pretty on board. If you got a Wachowski and you got two main actors, that's great. That's enough for me. That's great. I'm sure Rocco's going to go extensive on this on Sunday. But, uh... Yeah, absolutely there's some points out there like why no Lawrence Fishburne announcement uh, yeah that's that's what I was wondering it's like what are they are they gonna recast out. or are they gonna write them out or maybe it's trickling out maybe we said uh, I heard 
some talk in the back uh, shop here. Uh, what if they save him for like a, a surprise in the movie? You know, like, yeah. boom, some reveal or something. But yeah, very, very, uh, very good news. You know, I'd always heard that that was coming around again, but I will believe it when I see it, kind of thing. So I don't know. Here we are. Yeah. Um, but I thought you were going to ask me about uh, kind of the big summer blockbuster. I think I would consider Once Upon a Time in Hollywood. Yeah, mm, I, well, I, w- I was going to ask about that as well. Oh, gotcha. Because um, I haven't gotten yeah. a chance to really talk about it, but have you seen it yet, Brian? Oh, yeah. You saw Okay. I saw it within the first week it came out. Same here. Yeah. And yeah. I've seen it twice. I, oh, I, good. Lately, nice. I've been, been hitting the theater, and there wasn't just anything else I thought like I wanted to see. And Trisha and I both were like, fuck, let's just go. See- that was so good. Let's go see that again. Oh, that's I, good. I really enjoyed it. For... I it's my second favorite Tarantino film behind Jackie Brown now. I'm okay, dead serious. yes, I, See, I really love. I it. love the Jackie Brown gets love because that one is so underrated for oh, so long. Yeah, that one's. I great. don't. I don't think it's underrated. I think it's been critically acclaimed. I just think it's underseen. You yeah, know? That, I think people okay, just don't know it. Yeah, that's a better way of putting it. Uh, exactly that, Rob. It is <laughs> severely <laughs> underseen, uh, and, and I love that movie so much. The music in it, all everything. And uh, I think yeah. it's Sam, one of Samuel Jackson's best performances. Oh God, yeah. Um, oh, dude, Robert De Niro and uh, is that uh, what was the young blonde gal? Uh, I think that was. Um, oh it's, man, what's her name's daughter? It's that one actress. Fuck. Is it Bridget Fuck. Fonda? It is Bridget Fonda. You're right. <laughs> and uh, it's Jane Fonda's daughter, and she, the way she turns to him and asks him, "You want to fuck?" So you want to fuck? It's just yeah. like, oh, God. God, there's there's dialogue, writ- love or hate Tarantino, man. There's a style of dialogue he has that is so, uh, I guess it catches you off guard so well. And I, I feel like Once Upon a Time had a lot of stuff like that, too. Oh, as, yeah, the whole little... scene. Yeah. Go ahead. Oh, no, I was going to say the my favorite scene in the movie was um, actually... It, it, it was the scene that uh, a lot of people are kind of... Well, I actually probably... It's probably tied for my favorite scene. But I think it, it's the Bruce Lee scene. Yeah. And oh, yeah. That's I a cool scene. fucking loved Mike Created Mad some controversy, yeah, apparently. Yeah, yeah, it did. That was kind of fun. Apparently, Bruce silly. Lee fans are pu- are upset that you made him look foolish. I don't know. It's a made-up I, I don't, story. I, yeah, I, I, I just totally... I 100% disagree. I, I think it really kind of made Bruce Lee not as, like not out to be like this like in like this like i don't know like this idol he seems like a real person and he seems cool as fuck and yeah bruce yeah. lee was arrogant bruce lee was kind of this guy that was rising through the ranks of hollywood dude everyone in hollywood trying was to arrogant. Be number one <laughs> yeah, yeah. It, it was uh but, it wasn't done in like a tasteless way or anything i feel like it was done fine i think they explained it in the movie just fine they said that every so like every time that he was going on as his character. Uh, what was his name? I just lost it. Cliff Booth? Uh, no, the other one. Yeah. Oh, uh, Jack. I can't remember Leo's name. Leo DiCaprio's it ju- it name. It keeps just leaving my mind. <laughs> Honestly, like... Uh, What's his name? He's the star of the movie, but... Oh, uh, Rick Dalton. Rick, Rick Dalton. Dalton, yeah. He was being the heavy for for people's shows to, to show, like, oh, this guy... You know goes down and like to give you like oh this is a character that you can recognize and this character is evil and he's being the heavy for the good guy so you can see how strong the good guy is because he's taking down a credible character it's yeah. something that's done in professional wrestling that- when you're passing the torch your baby face your new baby face either puts over total correlation yeah into, into wrestling yeah so the idea is that you're seeing a guy this is what the scene tells you, but I understand why people had the controversy. The scene tells you that Cliff Booth is comparable to this guy in a fight. He can he can get some hits in, and he can be effective. That's the point of that scene. It's yeah. not to make... That was really the only stunts yeah. that the stuntman did in that movie. Yeah. You know, that was his role, but you never saw him doing stunts yeah. <laughs> interestingly yeah. enough and, and what's that. important but what's important about that scene though i think what a lot of people are forgetting about that scene is that that scene is a flashback that's what we're seeing is that from it's from right from cliff booth's perspective as he's on the roof right. so we can't really trust exactly if he even actually 
like yeah. managed to get a hit on um, on Bruce Lee. You know, and he could have been just imagining it, admittedly, like from his perspective. That's something I didn't realize until my second viewing. Yeah, uh, because Tarantino movies are always kind of spliced up and in and out of order. But that literally was exactly like you said, Rob. Like that was his memory of that. Yeah, that's why. He didn't get the fucking job, but that had happened earlier that day, and he's just re- reminiscing it, you know. Or I think it was from like a previous thing, and why and why he's not like there, and he was like trying to still get back in, and it was, and I think Rick had made a comment like, "Hey, I mean, they kind of don't like you for a reason," yeah. and, he, and then that's why he goes, "Yeah, I mean, that makes sense." <laughs> and that's yeah, and that's what's cool. Like, I think Tarantino does a really good job of telling you how he's going to tell the story. And then he does it that way, and all you have to do, all you have to do is listen to how he then tells you that story. Like in yeah, and he lets the audience, he lets the audience like make up their own minds. Like yeah. he's very good about ambiguity. Like yeah, and, and like for example, like whether or not, like this isn't a spoiler because it's it's not like it's not something that comes up in the movie. It's not something that's answered in the movie. Yeah, it's just sure. the question of whether or not Cliff Booth killed his wife. Yes, you know? yeah, like uh, and I love that you know. ambiguity of that fact like did he or didn't he like yeah you know it's he's up to the, capable of it it's something that he is tarantino's always been really good at uh letting the viewer decide like what's in the fucking suitcase in pulp fiction you know what i mean exactly you know exactly that's that's yeah, yeah. that's exactly it Garrett. did that's he kill exactly his it. wife would you have that's and that's a moral uh question too for men sitting in the audience like, yeah damn would you have killed that bitch <laughs> i mean all the stuff that she was saying and the oh, way that was he so felt fucking... after being in the war and all the things like it the makes stance it... But, but, has... one, but once again once again once again though you yeah. guys bring all that up and that's true but once again that's all from his point of view right so for right. all we know Exactly. Maybe yeah. she was a perfectly nice woman. He just thought she was a bitch. Yeah, know? exactly. True. True. Uh, but so, really, like, man, it made it made Brad Pitt very uh, ooh, likable. Out. Like, I, I, I hadn't seen Brad Pitt movies in a fucking bit. <clears throat> Not since Fight Club did I like him in a role as much as oh, I like this. Dude, you got to rewatch Glorious Bastards then. Oh, yeah. You know what? That was on not too long ago. Trish was watching that. And I stuck around for a bit of it. The part where Eli Roth comes out with a bat. Oh, and, dude. Uh, that scene. Fucking it. knocks out Air Corps. Air, what was that? Oh. Eichhorst from. Uh, that guy always plays a Nazi. He was yeah. he was a main character in The Strain. That, oh, he was? The German that, guy? The German guy. Oh. Such a like Nazi looking dude. I, I just I guess really, that's why he gets cast. I, I thoroughly in love. I thoroughly enjoy. I mean, in love and joy. This in love word. and joy. Uh, but I. I genuinely enjoy Aldo Reigns is his character in that oh, yeah. movie. He is when when he's bon talking giorno. when he's talking <laughs> about um, when he's talking about Eli Roth's character. I don't know if that was Tarantino or him. I don't know who was if it was director or actor, but the way that he describes that character, like he makes you feel every consonant of of his name. He's like the bear Jew. <laughs> and he like, he just really brings out the uh, that like he's makes trying it to reverence. scare that yeah, guy. Yeah, puts it refer- oh, fuck, put, re- puts grab. reverence behind it. Uh, oh, it. yeah, oh, okay. no, that whole scene is great, and I still can't believe that Adam Sandler was up for that bear oh Jew my role. God. What he was triangle? Yeah, yeah, Tarantino wanted him in that Eli Roth role. Oh, he wow. fucked up. Wow. A foogly foogly fucked up there, did you, Adam? Like that's terrible. What the fuck? Why wouldn't you? Hey, Garrett, you make that. You make that Adam Sandler you. impression. No Let's joke. There's a video on YouTube of someone editing in juice. Adam Sandler's laugh into the bear juice scene. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> yeah, how'd that sound? You gotta attack him in the back I... more, and not just stand in front. I'll, of I'll, I'll link that in the Discord. It's a really good video. Damn. Um, uh, I. I, I think like if a big act or a big director like if Scorsese or Tarantino yeah if they like ask you to be in their thing as a comedian I feel like that's always going to benefit you like Dice Clay was so good even in that Woody Allen movie like uh he was great in Star even Born. even I'll, I'll say uh <laughs> yeah, he's you know great. he he doesn't have quite the career hold that he did but uh Tickling him or are you killing him? I'm trying to tickle this little bitch. He's my dad, you know. <laughs> uh, I'll say that. Uh, well, we're talking to movies, so like, I, yeah, I know. I'm so not focused. I can't. 
come up with the Sorry guy's name. Sorry to distract name. you, Garrett. Well, I'm going to have to hang up in a sec, so we'll say our goodbyes. But uh, what was the, the other Woody Allen movie that they put uh, that comedian in? Who just... Louis C.K. Yeah. God, I could not think of that for fucking... Blue Jasmine? Too long. Yeah, Blue Jasmine I, I really liked. Um, I know, people are a little... Which dumb. one was the tennis one? Was that... Uh... God, but I feel like, it. man, if, if one of those directors, as, as an actor, if one of those directors asks you to be in a fucking movie of theirs, like, what are you, you... Adam Sandler said no? How much of that Netflix money did he get? I guess he got a lot. Yeah, I don't know. Apparently, it was just a matter of scheduling, I guess, huh. for Fuck that, Sandler. Dude. Like, you, he already had commitments. You make the schedule. You break the commitment for... for I don't know. I don't know. I, I didn't like... Maybe he didn't like the script. Inglorious Bastards, honestly, isn't my... It's not up there uh, with my Tarantino films, like my favorites. I, I like it a lot, but I agree with you. It's not my favorite. My favorite is still Jackie Brown. And yeah. I honestly think my second favorite is now Once Upon a Time in Hollywood. Yeah, it's... That's that, my second favorite. That's riding high after being so fresh with me, for sure. Yeah. But uh, I do... I think Jackie Brown might, might, might be my first as well. Pulp Fiction's way up there just because that was like, that was the one that in high school me and my friend found and watched over and over and over again. It's not over yet, yeah. Jackie. Oh, he ditched his octopi tentacles. Well, uh, thanks, Rob. Yeah. Good talking to you, dude. Uh, Any uh, closing yeah, thoughts before I leave you? And try uh, to beat this guy. Good luck at PAX. Oh, thank you. Uh, PAX is coming up here real quick, Ooh. Brian. End of this month, beginning of next month, we got to be up on the sixth floor. Back where you guys always, always do. Always up there. And uh, I will mention, tonight, Brian, is the last night oh, to get right. our Cry, Hate, Die 64-hour special. Oh, Hell fuck. Yeah. I do like this design. Hell yeah, you like that design too, Rob? Oh, oh. It, it's great. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Block and slice. Hmm. He's Grab coming to me. Ration. He's coming to me. Man, Metal Gear oh, Solid 2 is so fucking good. It is. This uh, These afterburners are killing me with this flame on shit, though. God damn it. So, uh, Rob, any last words? Because I think I'm out of you are. everything. I need but there to go. Is, uh, yeah. one in the oh, corner. no. What the fuck? You <laughs> went to your camera. God damn it. Oh, you got this, Garrett. I'm yeah. trying, but I got to get off the phone with you. Bye, Rob. See you guys. <laughs> Match Point was a good was the movie I was thinking of. Here he comes. Hit me twice, and then oh fuck, he goes for three. That's okay. You picked up that ration, so all you have to he do did? is equip it. Thought you did. Uh, 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 uh. I don't think there's another ration. No, I thought you, I thought you were around. A second one. Maybe go to the other side. Because there's see. another one there. Fuck. Also, if you attack him from the side, he has his eye patch. You won't see it. Thank you, sup dude, for that. Thank you, sup dude. That's pro strat right there. That is. Oh, thanks, Brian. Oh, God. But yeah, I think you got him. Just let him. I got him. I got him. Haha. Ha. Come in, come in. Third. Yeah. When he gets that fucking yeah, dude, he is like you are not doing any of the combos. The Japanese I don't know the combos. It's like just swipe left and right. Oh really? You're like Yeah, like when he's open you only hit him once. Oh, his hair looks like it he's bald. Left, right, I'm missing. That's the problem. And I'm on fire. Hit me. Hit me. Oh. You still got to have ration, so you're good. And three. Fuck. Hit him. Oh. Oof, if you're behind him at any point, I'll swing. And, oh, the ration's back over here. But, I mean, you could just hit him and you'll... Okay. Gotta make sure. 
Because I might miss. There we go. I really wanted Ooh. him to knock you off the side of the building. No way, Brian. I really wanted you to get knocked off so bad. Of course, that would never happen. Impossible. Damn, dude. Well done. The fight. You beat both bosses at the end of this game on your first attempt. Woo! It feels good. Uh... As the sparks fly, I wanted to keep uh, going on and on about that movie with Rob, but oh, you were yeah. right. I can't pay attention, so I was like, oh, my God, Rob, we have to go. I'm so sorry. No, but, that was uh, great. Thank you for the movie talk. I didn't get to really thank you, Rob. put it in there on the podcast. Uh, that was that was a good – I haven't seen a good movie in a while. I've seen some fun movies, you know. I still go to the movies a lot. I see a lot of shit. Yeah. But it's fun shit. It's popcorn. It's Marvel movies. It's fucking Hobbs and Shaw. Right. But like a legit good movie, I, I actually yeah. very much enjoyed Once Upon a Time. really did. Not since like, I want to say Hereditary, did I really enjoy oh, a really? film. Like I liked Midsummer, but it wasn't, it didn't hit as hard as Hereditary. I think it was a different kind of movie. I think it was more of a kind of like sunny witchcraft movie than a... Yeah. You know, like, dude, Hereditary was like a satanic fucking... Fuck. Jesus. It scared me, bro. It scared me, bro. Yeah. So, uh... So Japanese. I'm wiping the blood off my blade. I'm ready to start my fucking new life again. Oh, yeah, you gotta see Dragged Across... I gotta see Dragged Across Concrete, Yeah, I think, I think you'd really like S. Craig Zoller's... All of his movies. If you haven't seen, um... Bone Tomahawk... I haven't Crawl seen... Crawl Cell Block 99... Or Dragged Across Concrete. Those are three movies I think you personally would really enjoy. Oh, Practical wow. effects in those movies are very good. Very, very good. Yeah, I used to have a lot more time where, like, Frank would come over and, yeah. and like, me, him, and Rodrigo and, and uh, you know, everyone, would, Giselle, and, and, and did you come to those movie nights? We did it once. Uh, we tried to have these, like, yeah. movie marathon nights, but, fuck, I just have so little time. Yeah. Um, I haven't done that, and it's basically – what I'm watching is gonna have to be uh, equally agreed upon by my girlfriend. So pretty much, I don't know. I don't know these days how much bone tomahawk time I'm getting. You know, uh, it's she does. She loves horror movies. She watches She's, more than I do. She'd like those though. Yeah, I just have to get the thing is for me like I don't have easy access uh, to stuff unless I buy it right. and own a physical copy of it. And a movie like that, it's like, is it streaming on Netflix? Is it streaming I somewhere? I think it's like, on Amazon. Th then, then I could probably find it. Yeah. I feel like, too, nowadays, there's too much access. Yeah, so there's a lot of shit, so watch I have a list. I have an email list that's 70 fucking movies oh, yeah. long of, like, got to watch this other Gaspar No movie. Got to watch that new Harmony Korine Beach Bum. Still haven't seen. Got to oh, yeah, watch seen that. this show Euphoria seems really good on Amazon. I put that on the list. I don't know. There's just, like... So many. So much shit. Yeah. I got HBO now, though, so... Oh, nice. I've been checking out... Uh, I guess that's where that Euphoria show is. Uh, yeah, so it's on both because they have that deal with Amazon Prime where you can gotcha. watch, like, some shows on HBO. Bunch of kids in high school doing drugs and having sex. It's out there, man. Yep. It's pretty I guess cool. there were always that genre of film or episode. Oh, yeah. Know, episodic TV. So, like, reminds me of my so-called life. Like... Exactly. Freaks and Geeks. Yeah, or like Go, that movie. Go, I love that Go. movie, dude. That movie is such a fucking <laughs> 2000 movie. Yeah. It is so 2000. When the cat talks to the chick in subtitles because she's rolling remember, too hard. Dude, I just remember uh, it's fucking great. Timothy Olyphant was in that movie. And, uh, yeah, that's all I remember. That's Timothy Olyphant. Like, the, the main character, he's Bullock and Deadwood. And that's where <laughs> the first time I ever saw him was in that I think in that movie. Another show everyone told me to watch is Deadwood. Or you know what? He might have been like some Disney Channel movie or something, too. That guy was all over the place when he was young. Yeah. Anyway, I know random facts about random actors, so there you go. Well, as this game wraps up, we got time for maybe one more call. Okay. Uh, I don't want to cut any cutscenes, but we're getting we're getting awfully close to the right. end of the show, man. Yeah, we are. <laughs> I think in the next cutscene you can see Vamp in the background. Uh, really? Uh huh. You just have to press R1, I think, to zoom in. And then, because he's still alive and he's like walking around in yeah, the city. Yeah, I, I think it's the reverse shot. He's like hiding behind somebody. Oh yeah, this part fucked me up. 
Oh, yeah, like, what are those? Yeah. I wonder what they'll say for us. Oh. Garrett Hunter! Oh, my God! Dude. Who is... And, and Snake's like, what's that? And he's like, someone I don't know. I'm gonna pick a new name. Yeah. I'm gonna pick a new life. You were riding the whole time. Oh my god. They do that again in five, do you? Basically. Yeah. With the whole creator face thing. Yeah. So I think it was like behind Snake here when he turns around. Uh, uh, uh. Because he's not there. He's more towards the open I want to see that side. vamp. There's the body of Solidus. He died on the Washington Bridge. I feel like in the cut scene that goes live action, you can see some of the Kojima's production staff. Oh, like, really? Like standing next to the statue and stuff. I don't know. Someone, the outline is so poor in the FMV, but it looks like that could be Hideo. Maybe that's Shinkawa there. I don't know. Maybe. Was Ken Kendoza translating for them back then? Maybe it's Ken. <clears throat> <laughs> I like how calm the businessmen, though, on Wall Street are. Yeah. For the fucking giant That's the part that alien threw me spacecraft. Off. They're just like, yeah, we're looking at it, but we're walking to work. That, that was the part that threw me off so much when, when we were playing. When I played it through the first time, I'm like, did this actually happen or is this VR? Because some people seem to notice, but then like... yeah. I like how Raiden still has handcuffs on. Yeah. And these two guys in gear with guns and swords. Right. Nobody's talking to these no one's guys. No one's like, um, officer, uh, could you talk to the two ninjas <laughs> with right? fucking loaded magazines and weapons? Uh, <laughs> one of the guys got handcuffs on. He looks like he's up to no trouble. Up to some trouble. Excuse me. Hi, am I on the air? Uh, but, man, this is, uh, that's what I thought, too. Like, is this really happening? But yeah. it is. It is. But was Rose real the whole time? Who am I, really? Uh, I ask myself that question starting, all the time now. Starting over with because my Because of this game. Yeah, there think, she is. I think he's behind her to the left, maybe. Every vamp that you know is behind to the left. I don't maybe. see her. I don't see him. But uh, I'll take your word there. for it. You can see him a few times. It's not just like a one-time thing. Yeah. She's got her medical outfit on. Do you remember what day it is? I know. Jack finally realizes, oh, my God, it's the day we met. We talked to a tourist, and then we went on to the date of a lifetime, and I love you, even though I've oh. never seen your bedroom. Oh, E.E.'s e. bird lives. Let Freedom. Free Let free yeah, there he is. That you saw him? Yeah, he's in front of that taxi cab. He's just standing I missed there. it. Yeah, when when you get the reverse shot here, you'll see it. He's also just... Jack and Rose were the Titanic characters. Oh, there you go. Yeah, you see him off to the left there. No, not at all. <laughs> On the Rose shot, right? I see a bunch of dudes in other you know business suits. You won't be able to see it there. Now I my opportunity has passed. Nah, I kind of back up again. Like, he just hangs out there the entire time while you're here. Hmm. Oh, this is when you find out. It's the baby. Well, she told him, but he wasn't sure, like, was it the AI yeah. or what? But, you know, GW and the AI was bullshitting him, telling him they had Rose and his kid. You know, they really only have Olga's. They keep saying he. Yeah. So they're saying that it's a son, but we know it's Sonny. But these two about to make their new life for each other. Uh, I did want to jump into one more call, Brian. Okay. Just a <clears throat> real quick one. All right. How's, How's it, going? it going, Tylon? Oh, hey, what's up? What's up, Tylon? Good to hear your voice, man. Yeah, I'm Thank excited. You guys beat it. You did it. We did it, dude. You did it. Thanks for the gifts. You threw a little Twilight love. I mean, I haven't talked to my cousin in a while. Um... But yeah, if I could think of like, well, who would make a good antagonist? Oh yeah, I mean, ruthless shot a woman point blank in the forehead with a P90. Damn, execution style. I mean, that's ruthless. That's Twilight esque behavior, man. Mm -hmm. She yeah. hit me once with a Nerf bow and arrow dart right between the eyes when we were kids. Point blank range. She was just 
downwind. I popped out the corner. Bam! She fucking got me. And she burned Brian's pants. Well, yeah. She, did you oh, throw, yeah. You had to throw those pants away, yeah, right? Yeah, remember? Fucking Chewie oh, yeah. stole them out of the trash. Her fucking boyfriend stole them. I'm glad they've I, been gone. Yeah, I haven't seen him in a while, too. I wonder if that love lasted. See, here's where I thought, like, is that Kojima in the black jacket? Like, waiting behind the guy in the white jacket? These different guys from their staff waiting to take photos oh, in front maybe. of the Washington uh, statue? Could be. Could be. But uh, any last words, Tylon? It's been a busy week, you know. Rainforests are on fire. Yeah, it's hectic. Matrix 4 uh, is coming out. It's a whole fucking to-do. Yeah. <laughs> well, I guess if, uh, I guess last Say that one more time. You guys beating uh, Metal Gear. It's been... What's he asking for, Brian? I don't quite get it. There's a delay. I think he's saying that he's happy that we beat Metal Gear. Okay. And he's happy for us. And it's Tylon. Tylon. Oh, uh, sorry. Uh, I was saying like to celebrate the wheel. Yeah. Oh, he wants to spin oh, the wheel. Oh, I heard. I heard to celebrate your wheel. I think you're right, uh, Brian. He is asking. You're asking for a wheel he spin, is. Tylon. Yes. Yes. Oh that shit. Is, that is what I'm asking. Okay. All right. Well, stick with us. We we'll let this cutscene keep playing, so we got time. Hell yeah, cutscene, also known as credits. <laughs> Well, this is a credit cutscene. There's more dialogue. There is. The you gotta Avengers. find more about the Patriots. I hope it's show feet. It's prank call again. It can't see it. It's prank call again. Yep. All right, we got a prank call coming. A uh, little fingers music. Shouts out. We'll be right back. Thanks again, Tylon. Yeah, no problem. I'll you be sure to make a gift for Frank. You Thank got a, you. You got a prank call coming, buddy. Stay nice. there. Ooh. We'll be right back. Local Walmart. Whoa! I I have a local Walmart, right? Yeah. In our store. <clears throat> For pharmacy, press one. For electronics, press two. Mm. For pickup, press three. We do want electronics. For Brian. deli, press four. To speak to an ass Press two, baby. No, we did two, I think. Did we? Yeah, I did two. Oh, okay. Because I want electronics. We just uh. beat. Metal Gear Solid 2, I gotta pick up the next game in this franchise. Good idea. Uh, this is the only popular phone in the store. Someone should be on it. Who else is calling a department other than electronics? I know. I only ever call the big box stores and ask for electronics. Listen. 
Listen. Listen. Pick up the phone. Pick it up. And assist my cousin and myself in purchasing a new video game, please. We would like Metal Gear Solid 3 on PlayStation Snake 2. Snake Eater. What a thrill. National City Walmart, I'm help you. Hi there, this is a prank call. Can you hear me okay? Pardon me? Yeah, uh, I was looking for the electronics video game department. Is this video games? Yeah. Okay, hold on. Uh, hold on, and I will transfer you. Okay, hold on, please. Sure. Someone there's talking about Blu-rays. I think we're there in the right spot, right? Oh no. Okay. Guess not. I like my whole music better. Hi, this is a prank call. Hey, hello, this is a prank call. It's 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 a prank call. Hello? No one's picking up? Fuck, Brian. This cutscene's still playing, too. Aww. So, uh, another quick reminder. Shop.mega64.com. Get that last... Last chance. When the PPS goes off... That 64-hour special, Cry, Hate, Die, is gonzo. You can also pick up that Game Days ticket, right, Brian? That's right. November 10th and 11th, he just dropped the link. Oh, she fucking hung up on us. We're not getting through. Okay, call him right back. Just call him right all that's, back. That's Thank a you for calling your local Walmart. Yeah, my local. We I'm about to move. And look forward to the opportunity to serve you in our Here's store. Here's that last caller for last week talked about Tokyo Marui. Oh, for yeah. electronics, press 2. For pickup, press 3. You said 8 was for, for everyone else? I'm sorry, I didn't get that. Oh. So oh. For pharmacy, press Autocon is registered trademark that. of Autocorp. Autocon name is used with permission of Autocorp. Because I think it's a con. It is an actual it is a real con. Japanese yeah, animation it in MGS1. con. Call me Autocon for short. Tylon, maybe we called an extra busy game retailer tonight. Yeah. They're jerking off. It was something. prank call, right? I mean, I, yeah. It's there's a glare. Look at. Might be. It might be show feet. No. It's not show feet. You sure? No one wants to show feet anymore, Brian. I don't know. It's it's on, on, it is on here twice. Oh, hold on. I'm not on my phone. Hold on a sec. We were on hold. So, hello? This is a prank call? Hello. We were on hold for electronics. I was looking for a video game. Could you put us back in there? Okay. Hold on. 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 Okay. We're holding. <sighs> Hold on, 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 here's Solid Snake saying, live on. That's right. Pass along. Hi, is this Electronics? Hey, this is a prank call. We're looking for video games. Do you guys, is this the second time we've been transferred, but is this the right spot, the right venue? Yeah. Okay. Electronic, yeah. Okay, cool. Video games. Uh, my cousin Ariel and me just beat Metal Gear Solid 2. We want to see if you guys have Metal Gear Solid 3. Metal Gear Solid 3. That's what it, what, what's it called? Yeah, it's called Metal Gear Solid 3 Snake Eater on the PS2. <laughs> well, wait, no, it's uh, not PS2. No, <laughs> it's not, wait, hold on. It's got to be uh, Xbox or PS4. What do you have at your house? You have an Xbox, right? I have a PS2. No, it's not going to be... He doesn't have... Hold on, my cousin's dad's here. Hey, uh, Seamus? I told you, kids, no more games. Get off the no, phone. No, no, Get no, off no, the no, computer. No. no, listen. Get off. It's my allowance. I can head down to the fucking Walmart if I want. Hey. Excuse me, who is this? Sorry. No, no, no. Stop, Dad. Hey. It's Walmart. I'm... We're looking for... Uh... Guy's just doing his job, Dad. Do you guys carry used games? 
yeah, we don't we don't do 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 that do that do that do that do that do that do that. What do you want to do? We don't care. You okay? Oh, okay. Uh, Seamus, you gonna give us a ride down there anyway? Yeah, I'll give you a ride. I gotta get me some uh some coffee filters. You guys got coffee filters? I'm looking for the number four size. You got that? Yeah, we do. Can you transfer us back to the operator? We're not getting the game tonight, Ariel. You're not getting the goddamn Ow. game. Dad, you're hurting Stop my fucking yelling. ears. But if we could get back to uh, the operator. Uh, yeah, I can. I can do that. Keep it. Yeah, pass us along, would you? All right. You got it. Okay. Thank you. Hey, I'm gonna come back and say that. This kid was laughing. He was asking about PS2 games. Because I feel like he's transferring us to his manager. He's, yeah, he's all right. he's or he's putting us on hold forever. Yeah. But if we get back, I'm going to be like, uh, yeah, just got a really weird interaction. It's really that, odd. That's not a bad uh, result for this game. 15 hours. Did you beat it? Yeah, that's it, Sean. We did it. Thank you, no Help you. Hi. Uh, oh, you have a radio there. Hey, uh, a weird interaction. I was just calling over to look for a video game, but I think I was dealing with kind of a joker. He, he was asking, saying that they carried... Oh, no, Bobby is answering you? No, he answered. He said a PS2 games they had. Okay, hold on, hold on, please. Okay, Can we... I'll try, I will get somebody Well, hold on. What, what, hold on. It was Dolores? Ooh, meow. No, I'm we... just the operator, sir. Okay. okay. No need to get upset. I, I wanted to just see, can you transfer us? Because uh, Seamus wants to get some napkins anyway. Okay. So I okay, guess sir. housewares? What kind of napkins? I'm looking for the, the, the bifold napkins. You got the bifold? So can you transfer us to bifold? The, the what? Bifold napkins, preferably one in red, but I will, do, I will do a maroon. Okay. 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 Are you transferring now? <laughs> oh. Uh. <clears throat> now, we're looking for bifold red napkins. Because because. Sorry. We beat Metal Gear Solid too. Uh oh. What's all this stuff? Oh, you could enter that into the website and get, like, a thing. Return my clear code. I need to take a, a snapshot. All right. Let's see. Oh, I'm putting my password in on my, uh... Well, they can't see it, but... They can hear it. But it's funny. The phone screen was up, so I started pushing numbers. <laughs> that wasn't a password. Look at that. That's cool. Oh, you can't use it. Oh, the site's down? Yeah. Come on, man. Get us the napkins. New Ooh. item. What is it? Digital Ooh, digital camera. camera. From the jump, you get the digital camera. And the digital camera. Would I like to save? Pelican. Oh, I think it's saying that now it's available throughout both Tanker. Can you hear this? We talk right here. Yeah. yeah. Oh, you can hear that. Hello. Hey, Sean. Hello, hello. Could the caller hear me or should I talk in, in the mic? No, you could, the caller can hear you there. Okay. I'm just going to tell them that they were very helpful. That's good. So I got to get I gotta get home. You I do. mean, You got things to do. I got to eat a chicken sandwich, apparently. The, oh, the internet so is freaking out about, this fucking chicken about chickens. Nah. I'm going to eat one tonight, Sean. Yeah, I've had them before. They're good. They're fine. I've been to, I've been to Wendy's. <laughs> Yeah, why are we leaving the small fry out? Love, Where's the female Wendy's. representation? Wendy's my favorite. Man, I haven't had a square patty in a while. Dude, no, get the spicy chicken sandwich. Well, I do, but also I was just thinking about the Wendy's burgers. No. Nah. Yeah, that's like the expensive burger. That square yeah, patty? No, no, everything's You're square. So bougie. No, Wendy's? all the patties are square. No, dude, if you get like the the junior bacon cheeseburger, you get like a circle. Uh, no way, dog. Yeah. All the Wendy's patty. Can the chat back me up? I'm not insane on this. No, I think Sean might be right. I think Sean may be right too. It's a possibility. It's a possibility. Hamburgers. All right, let's. Click. Can't be. Can't be true. 
I can't tell if these are even square. Those anymore. are square, but that's the that's expensive shit. Dude, no, not just Junior a bacon bacon cheeseburger. Oh, it looks like a corner. Oh, that, that's false that's advertising, all... and I'm mad. I'm looking at the chat. Oh. Gotta be square. Square Bergs, they're with me, Sean. Square Junior <laughs> hamburger. That, Sean, I don't, I, you know, Sean, I, I felt like you were right, though. Yeah, no, I am. So I while, a lot of Wendy's. while we remain on eternal hold, <clears throat> hold uh, we got packs coming up, Sean. Oh, we yes. do. We do. It's in, uh, like... Sure. Dude, tomorrow, I God. mean, just now, I was packing up all the stuff. We're going to send it out tomorrow, and we're going to be there nice. in a week. We're going to have week. we're gonna have a full week of fun planned on the sixth floor. Check our Twitter for the booth number. Also, uh, check our Twitter for the new merch links. Yeah. I saw you showed off that water bottle, too. Dude, I'm so excited about the water bottle. First Hell reveal. Yeah. And, you know, I've tested these things out. It keeps your drink cold for so long. Oh. Nice. You ran extensive testing? I legitimately did. I got a cold drink, put it in my hot car, left it for two hours. Took a sip, still cold. Nice. Amazing. Amazing. Hell yeah. Hell yeah, dog. Well. They're I, not coming back. I think they're not coming back. That lady was, you know. Yeah. She saw through the ruse. Yeah. Was a little I wanted animated. to just get to napkins and thank them for being so helpful yeah. and like end it there but every once in a while you know we got ringing before now we're just on straight hold yeah so that means you're on back burner for life baby back we just we just got soft blocked we got to we did <laughs> we got shadow banned by Walmart dude yeah. <laughs> yeah. fuck well well until next week we did it. Thanks for coming in. Thanks, Sean. Good seeing you, man. You. We beat the game.